In this video, I'm going to show you how to make this cute gift card holder using the Pop and Cuts die. You open it up, and inside you've got a little pocket to put a gift card in right here. So I started with the Pop and Cuts die, and I just cut out a piece right here, and I've scored it at one inch three and a half and seven and a half and this is a really great die this is the deco labels pop and cuts that's in here and there's also the dress form too that's available and so I have a piece of coastal cabana and I've already put my sticky strip on it but I'm gonna stamp it first and I'm gonna start with coastal cabana and I'm going to use the Gorgeous Grunge stamp set. And this is new. And it's kind of an updated version of the itty bitty background set that Stampin' Up! used to offer. And so it has a nice splatter stamp that we're going to put on the top inside. And then we'll put it on this piece too, as well as this top piece over here. So we've got that one. And then we're going to use the little splatter piece to put some on the top. And then we'll use the stripes. And we can put some, put some over here, put some over there. Okay. So we've got kind of this splatter effect on both sides. All right, now we'll take a piece of Bermuda Bay and some Bermuda Bay ink, and we'll continue using the Gorgeous Grunge set. We'll use this stamp. I'll just do one here, one over there. And then we'll use the ampersand. It's kind of a fun stamp to use and the ampersand is actually from the Hello Lovely set. We'll be using more of that on this project too so this arrow is also from Hello Lovely. Alright and so now we can place this piece on here on the front. We'll do it this way and then we can trim off any excess that we have here. Next we're going to do a little element for the top of the piece. We're going to use some crisp cantaloupe and we're going to use the chevron oval and this is from the Oh Hello stamp set. Really cute, really fun and chevron is really popular right now. So we're just going to stamp that in crisp cantaloupe on crisp cantaloupe and we're going to use the one and three quarter circle punch to punch that out. And then I've stamped um, this thank you, you're the best stamp and I've already cut it out here. And we are going to use some glimmer paper and we're going to punch just a little scallop circle out of this from the itty bitty punches and we're going to adhere that piece right here and then we'll adhere this to this and then I've got uh, some dimensionals on it already so I'll remove the backing and that's going to go, we're going to wrap some ribbon first around this piece and we can go ahead and remove the red liner. So there's a piece right here of red liner that we're just going to put down. And then we're going to have the red liner as close to the sides as possible so we have enough room for the gift card. We'll fold that up. And then inside to kind of add a little bit of decorative um, flare, I've used the edgelet. Uh, this one from the Adorning Accents 
and I've just cut out a piece of coral calypso to add a punch of color to the inside of our project. And I'll just line that up up here. Okay. And then I've stamped uh, You Make Me Happy. And I've used the Bermuda Bay for that and for the inside on a piece of Whisper White cardstock. So I'll just make sure we ink that up really well. So we'll stamp that and then we'll trim it out. But before we do that, we'll go back to wrapping the ribbon around it. So I've got a piece of Bermuda Bay taffeta ribbon and I'm just going to place it in the middle here. And then I'm going to use the dimensionals that I've placed on this piece to hold it in place. So we'll kind of have fun and place this like this. And then if there's anything you need to trim on the side, we can trim some of this on the side. Okay. And then we're going to trim this for our little pocket. And then we're going to place this on the inside and then it's all ready to go. Great for birthday gifts, thank you gifts, teacher appreciation gifts, Mother's Day gifts, Father's Day gifts. Gifts cards are just really popular right now and everybody loves getting gift cards. So you can just stick it in there or you could uh, make a bunch of tags and put the tags in and it could be a gift of tags or you could put a little note in and it could just be a little note. So fun little project using the pop and cuts die to create a gift card holder. The last step is just to tie a fun little bow and there you have your project. Thanks for watching.